empowering women isn't just an idea or a concept. It is a necessity that requires strong, positive action to address deep-seated structural, institutional, and cultural barriers. Shipping has always been a male-dominated industry, and the same applies to many of the associated jobs and the profession in the maritime community. But this is changing. There are many reasons why. Gender equality has been recognized as one of the key platforms on which people can build a sustainable future. It is one of 17 goals that underpin the United Nations Sustainable Development Agenda, which countries all over the world have pledged to implement. The maritime community itself is missing out on a huge talent pool if it fails to properly empower women in the workplace. Gender diverse teams are more productive than male dominated teams, and the gender diverse workplaces promote better job satisfaction, employee engagement, and retention. Having more women in the workplace is beneficial for organizations as a whole, for men, and for women. And it is not just about numbers. Research has shown that companies with a higher percentage of women in senior management positions significantly outperform those that do not. IMO has been running a highly successful campaign to promote women in the maritime community for more than 30 years. Of course, much more work remains. It needs the whole of the maritime community, including IMO's member state and the maritime industry to come together and commit to ensuring that women truly are empowered. There are already some great stories out there, but this year we want to highlight as many as we can. And we want you to tell your stories too. So let us make 2019 a year of action, a year to break down all barriers empowering women in the maritime community.